least top 15 PGR in the last game consistently. Yes. Mars and Void. And here's the scary thing about Mars. Mars, every time he got PGR, he'll be like, PGR number 17, Mars. It's always in the back of your mind. He could have been number 11, but he didn't enter enough. Right. He, and like you said, even like this whole sponsorship shit, it can be so hard to find those opportunities because a lot of tournaments were going on on the West Coast and Mars being from New England was not able to get as much flights down there because it's just hard for him. So, yeah. I mean, there, there's always, there's always going to be, it's so hard to make the perfect ranking because you need every player to go to everything. Yeah. Technically, like, really, no. But, you know, it's all situational. And that's why we got people like k Taro that's really trying to help out these players to get out to as much events as possible. But hey, as much as I can, man. And we have the game about to begin already. These guys are already ready. I guess we're going to PS2. Oh, well, we got the out. Roy. I, I guess, is, is Roy just not going to beat you today? I wonder, man. He's your roommate. What's going on, man? You don't talk I mean, to him at home? <laughs> you guys don't cook dinner together and stuff? We do, man. Okay, well, what's I going definitely on? thought he was going to beat you today. <laughs> okay, I guess not. Boy, switching it up, going Roy. Let's see if he can do it. However, Zerusi Sam is a character that a lot of people think is not that good, but has been doing stuff. I know, I think yeah. it was Nairo Zerusi Sam, they could see Sam Sora. Like, come on. I think this character has some stuff, but I don't think that you can solo main this character. Really well. Yeah, I it, can, it, I can it's agree tough. I, I think she can be like a solid like high tier for sure, but it, it's just so hard. I feel like there's certain matches where it's going to be really hard for her. But for Side B, did have some interesting changes. Obviously, overall, the character is nerfed, but they, they, they did give her some stuff. Yeah, they did give her some stuff. And there goes the Mars special. Up B, <laughs> if I hit you, you die. If I miss, I'm dead. <laughs> I'm dead. The ultimate 50 uh, game. <laughs> however, one thing about this game, I've been noticing that up B special has been missing consistently. <laughs> but hopefully, we'll get it to work coming up soon. All right, let's ledge trap here, Void, trying to get the jab, but not going to work hard here. Mar Ooh, I like the mix of the jab one into the sidestep, getting out of that situation there. Oh, but here comes the up airs from uh, Void. Oh, and uh oh, here it goes. I mean, right. He's not going to die from that one. He's not going to die from that one, but that is going to be like 20 or so percent. And hey, here we go. Let's see that F-tilt coming out. Oh, that just straight up didn't work. <laughs> like that yeah. move just hit him and didn't work. <laughs> oh, a little bit late. And there goes the up, up speed again. He actually missed three in a row. However, that time he didn't get punished too hard, but that yeah, right there, Mars not pulling the trigger early. Void thought he was going to get pressured, did the directional air dodge, and Mars with the punish on the forward air. All right, and here we go. The combo's coming out, but that jab attack not being able to follow up after the forward air. Scary, scary. Down oh, smash. Edge. Oh, oh, wait, good kick. No. Oh. It looked like a mistake right there coming out that up smash. Back to a good kick. Not oh, oh, my God. My what wow. is Mars? He's like, all right, I was risky with those three up but I don't care. I'm going to go for this down air, and I know what's going to KO you. <laughs> you guys think up B, or you guys think the up were risky, but wow, that down air was super risky because he was, like, guaranteed that if he didn't hit that. Yeah, I, I appreciate, though, the even fact if he hit it, he that. died. Like, yeah. <laughs> like, even a top player isn't going to expect that to come out of nowhere, but 60% right now on Mars, struggling for there. Oh, another the combo. For there, three, not going to work here. This there is the dash attack. What's going to cover the landing? The back is going to hit Mars. All right, landing. Okay, I love that. He does landing up there, soft spot, into uh, other attacks or landing neutral air. Oh, there it is. And almost getting that upper conversion right there. Both of these players taking turn pressuring each other's shield. And Void Shield looking very tiny. Uh oh, has to watch out for this paralyzer attack, especially at 89%. What? No way, that's dead. Yeah, that's dead. What? what percent was that? He got hit to 99. Hit up to 99. <laughs> Wait, so after the hit was 99. After the hit was 99. When he got that side B, I'm like, okay, cool. He <laughs> might send him off the stage a little bit, but again. <laughs> That side B stronger than Krom's? Oh my gosh. Yeah, so if you guys do watch Void stream, he will kill people very early with that move. If you guys are interested in watching the stream, it's a uh, backslash GSM Void. Okay. Right. Yeah. <laughs> I, you know, I've watched the stream a couple of times. You know, pretty good. But yeah, he, he really likes playing Roy. Uh, he doesn't bust it out too much in tournament. I believe this is the first time we're going to see him like at a regional event or higher just busting out the Roy. We've seen it at earlier. Earlier part of the meta at the locals, but uh, now we're definitely seeing the Roy come out full steam ahead. Oh, yeah, let's see what it could do. All right, USB C charger. Oh, let me see. No, it's a charger phone, but here we go. Game number two. <laughs> oh my gosh, these up airs looking a lot like Krom. I actually don't see the up airs combo so strongly like I do Krom. I'll see like four up airs in a row. Yeah, Krom is, in my opinion, better at up airs. Yeah. Because it's just a consistent hitbox. Exactly. Oh my oh. goodness, what? And wow, from the grounded confirmation that neutral air into the flip kick, we still got it. I'm used to seeing the flip kick work in Smash 4 World. They'll like fly down slowly. 
But this one, he disappeared. Oh, yeah. Well, he was just gone. Oh, if that yeah. last hit hit connected, it might have been the stock there. 84%? What, <laughs> what is this character, dude? Roy hits very, very hard. He's got, he's got fire on his sword, dude. That is, I, I don't care. That's the fiery <laughs> intent. <laughs> All right, Incineroar, actually Incineroar does kill that early too, never mind. <laughs> something about fire, man. Yeah, something about that fire. But right now, Void struggling to get that KO right about now. 94%, 104. I don't think he's going to go off the stage, but that side B. Ooh. Oh, wow. Tried to it's flick gonna the go. shield and there it is. And that, that's such a mind game, just like dropping your shield and putting it back up. Because a lot of people see like, oh, no more shield. Like, let me do yeah. something. There's no double jump on Void. Oh, my gosh. That was nice. But again, oh. and it worked. What's that? <laughs> What even was that? I think he didn't hit with the last part of yeah. the side B. Yep. So the first part of side B knocked him down. See, there's weird things about this character that actually kind of make it better a little bit. A little yeah, bit. yeah. Not and better than last time, but like better in certain properties than last time. Yeah, she still got some. No double jump on point. The early up B is going to hit Mars, but oh that is going to do the trick. Nair in the down B. Still a thing, man. That flip kick, very, very strong. Very strong. Good stuff right there by Mars. He took that really clean. It makes you wonder if Void's actually going to switch characters or decide to stay the same character. I don't know. I'm convinced if he didn't go Pichu against Wadi, I, I I don't think he's going Pichu at all this tournament. Okay. I don't I, I, I don't know. Like, I, I, I haven't seen his Twitter or anything, but I don't know if he was just like, you know what? <laughs> going to go non Pichu characters for, for Heart of Battle. I don't know if he said that yeah, or not, but yeah. it, it definitely Twitter. seems like that. He announced it on his Twitter. Oh, he did announce that on his he Twitter. He did announce it on Twitter? Okay, thank you very much, my boy. Yeah, uh, we totally knew that. Warchief, let's yeah. go. Let's go, Warchief. Yeah. Right, and it looks like we're going to see that wolf coming out. Okay. All right, the upgrade. See. It's like you start <laughs> off with the Roy. Yeah. You beat the Roy. You get the wolf. You beat the wolf. You still get the wolf because it seems like he will not go peachy today. Yeah, and you know what? Void, me and Void have been talking a lot, and we kind of don't know what to really think of Roy. Like, he's good, but we don't really know how good. And like where he will really fit into the meta. What so in I, the world was that? That was a lot of damage. <laughs> what? Eighty percent, one down smash away. Go for it. All I'm saying is, guys, Void is labbing this character, and Void is insanely good at optimizing combos. So just like we're gonna see a lot of crazy combos coming out from Void's Wolf in the future, for sure, guaranteed. For certain, however, it's gonna. Oh my. Okay. okay. All right, 151 percent. How do you that rack that much damage in 30 seconds? Like, how do you even do that? There's how do you some, even do that? This character sneakily is like a top tier, and people just don't know it. They just see a lot of top. Uh, what is it? A lot of top players picking up wolf. Like, oh, they're picking up wolf. That's kind of cool. That, no. Yeah, wolf. Wolf is cool, man. He's a cool looking character. Man. Zach Ray went from <laughs> the iPad, bro. <laughs> exactly. Zach Ray went from being number eight in Japan. You know, of course, the number <laughs> to number one uncontested with Wolf. Yeah, he just got lucky. Uh, thinking emoji. I don't know, man. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, well, here we Nothing go. Nothing to take away from Zachary, of course. Oh, an amazing player. Amazing player with an amazing character. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> But Mars off stage? And I like that Mars went off the stage. Like, oh, oh my goodness! Oh, oh. Okay, it's the down air master, dude. Yeah, I, I feel like the up, up B that he tries to go for. Thank you. Up B that he tries to go for, not working out so much, but the down air is working out fantastically. Oh yeah, for sure. The Mars. Boy, pressuring. Ooh, the grab. Wow. It's so interesting seeing a tether grab and a normal grab do that. Yeah. <laughs> like, very weird interaction. There's a, there's a weird thing about this game where tether grabs, people used to say, like, aren't as good as normal grabs in the last game. However, these normal grabs, they barely reach anywhere in this game. Yeah, grabs in general got nerfed. Ooh, and throwing the charge a little too early there, Void able to punish with the wolf flash. That was good stuff. Good reaction coming out from the Void. However, that up B, the there bar is special. 101% when it began. Okay, a lot of toss. All right. <laughs> the power of light is in Mars. Yeah, that dash dash is totally can really run for Void right about home. What? So if you hold side beat um, on her way back as she's pulling the whip back, it'll actually um, hit you up like that and you get a combo start. My goodness. There's a weird thing about this game when people do multi hits. Back in the old game, I feel like you could block and kind of let go after a while, you're fine. In this game, the multi hit stays out so long when it hits your shield that you just you have to keep blocking, otherwise, you get hit by that last hit like you just saw there. Yeah. And like such a long hit. It's, really cool. it's very funny because. Uh, Zero Suit Side B is like one of her main tools, and that's how she played in Brawl. Very yeah. interesting enough. The up beat, not going to be quite at 9-up rate on Mars. The up beat to the ledge, going to be safe here. The kick, not going to connect. All right, misses that back air. That's going to be a clean back air conversion. And yeah. Mars misses the second hit, but the, oh. oh my goodness. This is yeah. why I like Wolf. He might be crazy. He might be a really good character. Crazy on stage, yeah. crazy ledge trap options. However, he cannot recover sometimes. I do think if uh, Void did the angled up Wolf Flash, he might have been able to make it back. Mm -hmm. Distance-wise, that's your your farthest recovery. But obviously, it does not snap on the way up there. There are some cons. Um, can be easy to edgeguard or if you throw out that counter by the ledge. But right now, Mart's up 2-1 versus CLG Void. I don't know if Void is ready to lose right now. 
That's why I feel like he's thinking, and I think the Roy is the better option. Yeah. Was it the Roy that took the first game? Yes. Okay, it was the Roy that took the first game, then he lost the game. He decided to go Wolf, lost the game, and it wasn't that close. So you might as well go back to Roy. You might get that side B at early percents, and he took it back to FD. I can see why. Remember, he likes FD for this character, kind of small stage. Able to not have to deal with the platforms and do well. Right, we'll see with the delay, and again, I mean, like you said, he likes to do that short hop rising side. Great anti air, you're kind of just like extending that. And Zero Suit, definitely a character that operates from the air. Just wants to throw out, do a lot of falling aerials or just set up with that side. Yeah, clean. All right, forward air. That forward air is weird. He actually falls like out of the a lot, right? Yeah, yeah. That's, that's kind of weird. It's kind of sus, man. Oh, wait, oh and there's God. a flip kick. Still has that flip kick, neutral air and flip kick. Fantastic stuff coming out there. Okay. Yeah, neutral to flip kick definitely is still a staple for Zero Seed Samus. Able to seal out those stocks at around 50 ish percent, and that's such a strong tool to have to be able to end the stock like that so close to that. Alright, and boy getting that up air needs to put Zero Seed Samus above him. That's a really good spot. Do not want Zero Seed Samus sitting on the ground. That's where Mars wants to be. And we're not seeing those up B out of shields right now because up B out of shield from the left side to the right at 75% won't get a KO. But we might see it coming out pretty soon, especially at 92 at the oh, left. Oh, there it is. They're oh. there into the back air. No. All right, decided to be really patient, but Void is saving the air dodge until the end. And no sweet spot on the exit. Yeah, definitely. I mean, oh, wow. And two framing, not get your jump back. That's a really big deal being able to hit that two frame. And that's one thing uh, Prom can be a little bit more consistent at. I can just hit any part of my sword at like, you know, at a decent kill percent and just always nail the stock instead of having to worry about those sour spots. Double spot dodge coming out again against Void. However, Void playing it really patient, knowing that Mars is likely going to go for something risky. We always see him go for that. So he's like waiting for it. Okay, okay, okay. Oh! Oh, and there's the punish. Void holding that needs to be a little bit too long. Wow, and actually Mars had playing Zero Suit Samus, one of the few characters that can actually punish something like that. Yes. Go completely, yeah, against over the character and actually get the KO to work, and I don't wow. blame him. I noticed that Void goes for a lot of risky moves himself too, because he's like, I need this KO, I need to even it up right now. Oh, there's a bear, almost catching Void jump there. That would have been tremendous offstage. Oh, the back air not going to fit for Mars, you need to click the reset, but aggressive landing with the down air. All right, and back air has him offstage, you know Mars is going to go crazy, and he's going <laughs> crazy! <laughs> that flip kick, such a gigantic...